Hey you guys, it's me Jess and I'm back again with another video and this, I know it's been a while since I've been on here but I've just been busy doing other things. So anyway, um, this is going to be a purse review video. This video is not going to be long at all. Um, I have been wanting to do this video for a while and just never got a chance to so I'm like, I literally like just woke up and I'm like, I want to look at the purse anyway so I was like, okay, let me just go ahead and do a video, alright? So let me just say this, this is going to be like the, the last unboxing that you are going to see from me for a very long time. I will continue to do purse videos but it's just going to be, it's going to be on purses that I've already purchased that I haven't worn yet that are brand new and I'm going to talk about it. But as far as like your unboxing, no, this is going to be the last one for a while because guys, I have ordered a lot of purses since last year and um it just got out of control and so i'm really trying to get back on saving and stacking my money so i have actually been cutting back on my spending so i have not ordered any purses i actually forgot i ordered this purse i ordered this i want to believe i ordered this back in like early january and it literally just got here like two weeks ago i believe like a week or two ago and i still haven't opened it yet so i was like you know what i'm gonna go ahead and just open it now and do the unboxing so that y'all can see but yeah i have not bought this i bought it from the same company i told y'all about last time that i bought the other gucci purse from and um you know they take a while to deliver and i literally like forgot about this purse i ain't gonna hold you so when i saw it at the you know get delivered i'm like oh yeah that was a purse i ordered so um yeah but anyways so y'all saw the last one i did on the red gucci mormont so this is another Gucci Marma. I have the red and the black. And I had seen somebody on YouTube do a video on the tannish color one. And I really loved it, especially for spring. Um, the weather's changing where I live at. It's getting so nice. So that I was like, this is going to be the perfect um, purse for the spring and the summer. Okay, but yeah, this is going to be my last official unboxing. Everything else is going to be just new, brand new purses that I just have not that I've already opened that are on my shelf, but I haven't worn as yet, okay? Um, Cause like I say, people, I'm telling you, when you see people on here doing these videos, we're spending a lot of money. Now this did not cost me a lot, obviously, y'all know why. But um, yeah, but my other purses, yeah, I have spent a lot. So I'm just getting back to like, um, just watching my budget. Um, I really don't need anything. I have a lot of clothes, shoes, purses. There's really nothing else I need, you know, but sometimes we get caught up in what we want, all right? So, anyways, so we got the Gucci Mormont, okay? Um, if you, any information that you want about the purse, just message me on my Instagram. I'm going to put my Instagram um, name in the, um, in the description. And if you want to know exactly where I purchased it, how much I paid and all that, then just, and you want the seller then just message me. The last time I did the video on the red Gucci Mormont, a lot of y'all did go on there and go on my Instagram. You have to follow me first because I put my page back to private. So you have to follow me first, of course. And then I will, once you have actually put in a request to follow me, then I will go ahead and respond to your, your message and tell you all the information that you need, okay? So anyway, I can you can already tell this is gonna be a goodie. That's the reason I keep getting from this seller. Cause I'm gonna tell you about the trick with this website once you're actually getting a genuine box and this box actually looks like this is like the best this box is like in the best shape um yeah i had it upside down yeah this box is actually in better shape than the other ones i have but anyway once they kind of once they give you like a, a real genuine box you know you finna get something good okay so um it was wrapped up in the regular um postal packaging and then when i opened it it was in this plastic okay so we just gonna go ahead and um open it i'm gonna just i don't want to break my nails so i'm just gonna use this tweezer to open it so yeah guys i mean yeah i've been wanting to do this video and i was like let me just go ahead and do it right now okay so guys this it has just one not that we i really don't care about this but the other boxes were a little bit more damaged but this one this has this little tear right here but other than that it's a really nice gucci box so that, like i say normally when they actually go and give you all this it's normally a good sign that you're gonna get you know something that looks they're a really wonderful um bag okay so here we go that's the color that we get in today so so gucci marmont 
So I'm opening up the box. So of course they're giving you the authentication papers. Okay. So I'm gonna put that to the side. And this is how it comes, okay? So, like I said, if you watched the Red Gucci Marmont video, if you haven't, go ahead and watch it. I'm not gonna give any more, too much details, but if you were paying attention, you know where the last one came. I got it from the same, same website, same seller, okay? So, and this is a little bag. Um, the duster that it comes in and it has the Gucci um, symbol there and now we're going to take out the purse so oh here we go okay this is really nice now I will say I do like it um, it smells it just smells like leather to be honest it's not really no weird smell it feels amazing just like the other purses just like the Gucci black and the red the only thing I'm noticing you guys is that it's not as big as the other ones. I'm going to pause the video and get the other bag so we can kind of compare the size. So I'm looking at, I know right away, and I, I purposely bought the size because this is the biggest one they had to offer, but this is really a nice, cute bag. So I want y'all to look. I really love this color. Okay, so there we have the Gucci symbol. And um, it's, it's stitched up really nicely. Like, I'm not seeing any loose threads or anything like that and of course you know they have that like triangle layer with the heart like that's how all the gucci bags are so yeah yeah i like it okay so um of course they have the emblem covered in plastic so we're gonna a protective plastic so we're gonna take that off and then this the handle this is the um the adjustable chain strap which y'all know i love i love adjustable chain straps i really do so i'm gonna just go ahead and take the protective plastic off of there and then um i'm gonna stand up i'm gonna try it on for you guys just so y'all can see where it hits me and uh we'll take it from there Okay, so there's the plastic. I like that they do this because it just gives like extra protection to the purse. But yeah, but we definitely gonna compare it to the red and the black. So the black one was from a totally different seller. Um, but yeah, you can definitely feel the difference in quality with this particular. I mean, honestly, they all feel good, but the black one, I, I did pay a lot less. Um, it's still a really nice bag, but it did have one loose thread that I had to cut. But once I cut that loose thread, we were good. Okay, guys, so here you go. So, of course, with the adjustable chain strap, you all know how that goes. You can either wear it on your shoulder like so, or you can wear it drop down. Okay, guys, this is going to be a real quick video. I'm not, normally in my videos, I give y'all like specific measurements and all that. I'm not doing that today. Okay, but yeah, this bag is a lot smaller than the other two. I was hoping it would be about the same size, but it's not. I thought it was going to be a 26, that's what they said, but it's actually a lot small. This more looks like, I wanted the medium, this looks like a smaller one. It's still fine though, I still like it, I'm still going to rock it, it doesn't matter. Um, now, with the way Gucci is, I like that they do this, they have this additional protection. So, it kind of reminds me of like the, um, what is it, the... Porsche Matisse, the Louis Vuitton Porsche Matisse has like a security feature where you just can't open, even somebody was to roll up on you, they just can't open it back. They would have to actually go ahead and squeeze and go through all that. So it's the same thing with this. It doesn't have the squeeze on the side, but it has this push. As you can see here, there's like a little push button. So that's what you have to open, you know, for the bag, okay? So I'm um, guys, I'm not gonna lie to you. This is a genuine leather bag. So regardless of what we already know what's going on here, it's a genuine leather bag. The, the quality is amazing. If y'all could like feel this, it is so soft and buttery. Okay, so you got, hey guys, I'm not doing what fits. Um, we're just gonna kind of play around with it. But yeah, it feels really good. It feels like a kind of a microfiber material inside kind of. 
All right, so this feels really good. And so you got this in here and there's, uh, you do have a little compartment here, a little slit there. And um, you got this little zipper here. So let me try to open it. So this you can kind of maybe throw your cards in there like our little uh, card case that we have. We can put that in there. Oh, here we go. All right, so it has like this little compartment here, okay? Of course, nothing on the outside. So um, I'm gonna tell y'all right now, looking at the size of this purse, like I say, it's way smaller than the red. The red and the black was way bigger. So I know for a fact I won't be able to fit as much in here as the red, black, as the red and the black Gucci bag I have, which I'm going to bring out in a second. Um, so what I'm thinking, this definitely, your phone can go in here, your slim card case that you always see me put in there. I have my coach slim card case. Some of y'all have the Louis Vuitton one. I do want to get the Louis Vuitton one from the same website, okay? And I want to get the key holder. But yeah, so your bag, I would not put the, your, if you have a big wallet, I would not put that in here. I would just put my phone, my slim card, um, my slim card ID case, the slim one. And um, you're definitely, can, you, which I can look in here, of course, your car keys and um, maybe your lotion and hand sanitizer, maybe a pack of tissue at best. Really just your essentials, right? And really and true, that's really all we need to walk around because I've noticed lately, I'm going back to walking around with extra stuff. You know, the mail comes, you throw your mail in there, all this extra stuff. You really don't need to be bringing a whole bunch of extra stuff in your purse. Just walk around with your essentials. And honestly, it's not good for your shoulder and your bag to, to be carrying a lot of extra things. Okay, so anyways, guys, I'm going to, um, I'm using this shoulder, guys. This shoulder is all messed up. Like, I have, like, a mild form of scoliosis. And so, now that I'm getting older, it's actually starting to get worse. So, like, this whole area, like, my shoulder here down to my arm is in a lot of pain. So, I've actually been, like, going to therapy for it for twice a week. And I have to do it for the next couple months. That's another reason I really haven't been to most make videos because I've been in a lot of physical pain. Even though I'm still eating right still working out but i mean there's just some things that start to happen as you get older so but anyway let's look and see how this purse looks and i'm standing up okay so all right y'all uh, okay so i told you you have the you uh, yeah i can definitely see how small it is i def this is not a purse i would take to work with me this is definitely like you know going out on the weekends running errands and things like that but yeah so, and it look, you know, I like with this color because this is like a neutral color, so it can go good with like any like color outfit. Like right now, I have on this really nice gray dress. I just got this, I actually just got this dress from um, from Fashion Nova. I actually love this dress. So this actually complements it really well, okay? And because I have, and actually I have some nice shoes from Nine West that are, are the same color. So yeah, so this, and I'm five ages, so y'all know, so you can see where it hits. And um, you have the adjustable chain strap, and there you go. So, but I actually like this size, even though it's not as big as the other ones. I actually do like this size. I think it's just a perfect size just for like going out and you know running your errands, going to the mall, the, the supermarket, that type of stuff. Okay, guys. So this is what it looks like and guys i'm still on my weight loss journey so i will be i'll actually want to start doing some videos on that too like where i'm at with that okay and honestly because of the issues i've been having on my back my doctor my chiropractor wants me to lose like 20 pounds and he's really serious about it so um i have no choice but to get on my shit to be quite honest so i would actually like to go back and do some videos not a whole bunch but just a, a video here and there just tracking like what i'm doing about like weight loss what i'm eating what at what workouts I'm doing and stuff like that. Okay, guys, so let me go and get the red and black bag so we can do a little comparison. Okay, guys, so as soon as I went to my shelf, I was like, oh, yeah, big difference, okay? So, um, and like I said, this is my last bag purchase for period. But I will say, you know what bag I do want to order? I do want to order the, um, the YSL 
um, the YSL Puffer Lulu bag. I do want that. So I'm going to be going back to the same website. The reason I don't mind that website because really and truly, we're talking about getting a really nice purse for like under $100 or under $150 depending on the quality of it. Um, so, you know, of course we know how much the original YSL is. It's like... 3000 of course you can get pre-love for me like 1500 but i'm not i'm not trying to do that either so yeah but anyway because really and truly like as long as i know and i feel good and i'm looking good it doesn't matter but anyways so i bought when i bought this purse, like i said i'm still happy with this purse but i do wish it was a little bit bigger but like i said i still like the purse i'm still gonna rock it but i am surprised at how much smaller it is because when i ordered it i was thinking that i was getting the same because this was the biggest size they had so I'm thinking, and I'm wondering if they made a mistake because I know I, I put 26. So I don't know, but I was hoping I would get a bag that was as big as this one. Now we're talking as far as like, if you want to be able to throw a whole bunch of stuff in it. And I love y'all, y'all don't even know the half of it, Like I love this red bag. So, and this one was actually slightly, I think the last time we did, uh, I, I did a video on this, I showed y'all that it was just slightly bigger than this one. But yeah, but this was a totally different seller. Um, this seller didn't even come with a um, with a box. I paid way less for that one, but this was still a really great quality bag anyway. Um, but yeah, of course, this one was one of those that actually did cost more. It was like 150 and I got on, I didn't, actually no, this was like 200 something dollars, but I did get it on sale. I know I paid like, I think I paid like 60 bucks or something like that. And it was originally like $250, $280, something like that. So yeah, but when I, and I, the, now these two are from the same seller, same great quality. The leather feels amazing. Like y'all, cause like I say, a lot of people don't realize when you go on that website, you are getting genuine leather. You know what I'm saying? They're just, we know what the deal is. You get what I'm saying? So it is what it is. But yeah, I ordered this thinking I was going to get the same size. Um, but no, cause this was a 26, I believe. I could have sworn it's, I think it's like 24, 26, but it really should have been close to this size. So I'm really wondering if they made a mistake, but I mean, it's all good. I'm, I, I love the bag, so it's no worries. But yeah, you definitely can see this would be more so like this was, I think this would be like a, I think for them, they consider this a medium. So this would have been like a small or whatever. I don't know. But yeah, as you can see, same seller, same great quality. Um, but yeah, this is significantly smaller, but like I say, I don't care because I still love the purse. Um, I love this one, so I'm glad I got the red because it's always nice to have a really good red bag in your collection. Um, and yeah, that's it. If you turn around, same thing as far as the, um, the stitching, the decor. So yeah, I just wanted y'all to see. Yeah, same seller. Um, I was thinking I got the same size. I don't know why they sent me one that was so much smaller, but once again, I still love it. I don't care. I'm still going to be wearing it. I'm still going to go out in it. Um, and that's it. But I just want y'all to see the difference in size. I was expecting to get something this big, but, and guys, if y'all trying to go on that website and get y'all purses for the spring and the summer, you might want to start looking now because you want your stuff to come in on time. You know that they take a while. I ordered this in January. It just came like two weeks ago. So it took like two months to get here, right? So you don't want to wait too long. Like it's now the first day of spring is next week. Is this week? So you want to make sure that if there are certain purses or colors that you want that you're ordering from now. Every seller is different. Um, the Louis Vuitton um, Porsche Matisse, the first one I bought, because I bought both colors from the same seller. I got the one that was just all brown and the other one that was like the the cat, the the, the one that had like a tannish was brown, but then the flap was like a tannish color or whatever. Um, the first one came within two weeks. So I got excited and went, jumped right ahead and was like, hey, I'm gonna order the other color. That one took like two months, you know what I'm saying? So it just depends. Um, yeah, but anyway, so guys, that is it. That's the end of the video. Um, I hope you all like it. Once again, you want information on the seller. Um, if you are, if you watched my video with for the red um, Gucci purse, and you already um, and you already messaged me about the seller and all that. It's the same information you got from the same person. Um, so, but yeah, if you haven't already, I will definitely put that information in the description box, and I will let you know what's going on in Instagram. Okay. Anyway, you guys, thank you so much for watching my video. Like I said, this is the last 
official unboxing because I'm not ordering anything else for a long time, at least at the end of the year. And I'm serious about that. But will I continue to do reviews on the purses that I already do have? Yes, I will. And I have other videos I want to do as far on my health and wellness and things like that. All right. Well, anyway, guys, thank you so much for watching, and I'll see you next time. Bye.